everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Yellow LP. I'm Ben Gang, this is the Trankless Warrior, and I decided to pick this back up again mainly because I was talking to my woman today and she said she wanted it yesterday. <laughs> yeah, kind of weird, right? We basically picked up where the last one left off, uh, just traveling basically. It's pre edited, so I couldn't exactly do it like that if I wanted to cut everything out. It'd be really weird. I don't like talking at once and then stopping or having to go back in and cut out dialogue and stuff if I'm messed up somewhere. Uh, good thing that YouTube lets you put up 15 minutes on time. Sometimes, oh, I've seen 10 hours, so probably longer than that, so it was probably like 10 hours plus. I don't think it's unlimited, I don't know. We said take off this 10 hour thing, though. Uh, but you're going to see every Pokemon at least once. Pidgey, possibly a couple times. Uh, <laughs> you know, I don't know if I've got one or not yet at this point. Pikachu grew level 7, so that's always good. Uh, I'm going to try to catch as many Pokemon as I can. I'm not going to make this, you know, 150, 151, however many there are actually in this game that I can get to. Why it records like that, I don't know. Uh, that would have been a Pokemon you've already seen. More than likely a Pidgey. <laughs> Just saying. Like, that probably was too. Or a Rattata, huh? I'm not sure. Guess what? This is a surprise to you as it is to me. Well, like I said, my woman said she wanted this yesterday, and she's obsessed with Pokemon. Well, sometimes she is. Ugh. I'm sniffling today. Sometimes she's obsessed with Pokemon. She, her, she's more obsessed with Pikachu. Uh, unfortunately, this is the first time you come here, it's rel relevant to the plot, so... But this time, I'm just stocking up on Pokeballs. At least ten of them, basically, so I can have a good chance of catching some new Pokemon. Especially when you get ready to go to the first gym, it would be nice to have a Pokemon that's actually good against rocks. Everybody's played this already. It's not being ruined for anybody. If you haven't played this, something's wrong. I'm just playing it because I was asked to, and she wanted it, and I'm doing this for her, so she'll get over it. I'm actually trying to talk her into doing the, uh, a Super Mario World video. She's terrible at Mario. I should try to make her play the first one instead. Uh... That guy, I think he has, like, Dream Eater or something once you get cut. Uh, if you would have kept going that way, you would have ran into uh, Gary, and his Pokemon would have been a little bit higher levels. But before, you couldn't get past this guy, so... Now you can. And apparently I sat here for a second. Sure, you can go through. I'm sorry, I was so rude to you. You weren't rude to me. I don't even think I talked to you in my last episode. <laughs> it's been that long since I put one up. And he'll show us how to catch Pokemon as a positive. Gee, thanks, throw a Pokeball. You know, battle item. Pokeball! Throw! Yeah, whatever. I don't really need this. Especially when this old man decides, you know what, if you haven't played this, let's just shut up about it, because I believe he misses. <laughs> yeah. And this one he seems to miss. And then he has to go buy more Pokeballs at the end. He seems to be losing his touch. I must be losing... my touch. Well, you're kind of old, dude. That's not the only thing you're probably losing. Probably losing your mind too, going senile and shit. Uh, just you're, you're becoming enraged with the thought that you're actually worth something anymore. Now, old people are wonderful. Can you feel the sarcasm in that statement? Uh, I believe this is where I decided to go off and look for some more Pokemon, and it didn't work, so I just kept on going. Why it jumps like that? I'm not quite sure. It's, it's not editing because it's clearly a walkthrough. A, a walk through, a perfect walk, and then it just glitches for a second. I don't, I don't understand that. It doesn't last the two. Maybe he just doesn't like this type of game. I, I don't know. Oh well, I'll get over it. That's being recorded through like a VBA S something. I don't know what it is exactly. It's got some numbers to it. Uh, and here we went to our first Caterpie, level three. So that's lovely, right? weak Pokemon in here, though you have to be careful with some of them, they may poison you. You can't be poisoned in here. And I guess I just wanted to kill this one. Or was I trying to weaken it? I don't remember. Like I said, it's a surprise to you as it is to me. I'm doing it because, and I'll say it again, I'm doing it because she wanted it yesterday. Meaning she told me at like 4 a.m. today that she wanted it yesterday. Uh, so I'll be doing this on Saturdays from now on, maybe a little bit earlier. Maybe I'll just move it up a day so she can watch it on Saturdays. Uh, you know, she has a channel on YouTube, but there's nothing on it right now. I wish she would put something on it. Other than 
doing that. She's just wasting it. But here's our first female Nidoran, I believe. Uh, which we are is it wild, I don't think. I think this was the trainer Nidoran. I think I'm in a trainer battle. I wasn't paying attention, sorry, I was too busy ranting. And like I said, this is pre recorded, so whatever I say, it might not match it. <laughs> uh if anybody's actually watching this, I could use some uh apparently Pikachu Lord's Thunderwave a little late. Use some ideas for a fail of Fridays. I've been doing a lot of stuff because I can't think of anything else to do. And if you've watched those, I really have failed in that. Like terribly. I made it to I made it through one level the last time. One. One. Three four. I made it through three four and then I died on four one. What the hell? I need practice at that game. But I don't want to do it because that would ruin the, the failing part, you know. I don't want to get into it too much that I don't have fun when I'm failing. Like, it's, it's a fun game so far, and, and I've never beat it. I've only played it up to my extent of playing it. It was probably 1-3 back before I got into 1. I just couldn't figure out, what the, what the hell? I was staring at like, what, the, what am I supposed to do here? But now I, I'm getting hang of it. And we went to another Caterpie, which if this isn't in here, I guess I catch this one. Uh, go ahead, Thundershock that Pikachu. Thundershock the shit out of that thing, Pikachu. Caterpie. I guess I was playing smart this time around if I wanted to catch it. Like I said, I'm sniffly today if you heard that. I tried to cover up the microphone, but sometimes it doesn't work. Uh, but no, if you've got any ideas for fail video, for fail Fridays, let me know. Give me some ideas. I can tell you I haven't played any of the Mega Man's on the NES. I, I, let me rephrase that. I played like the first, one of the first, one of the levels out of one, and it was terrible. I couldn't do anything in that game. It was that bad. I, I totally suck at that. And there we go, catching our first Caterpie. If you touch the feeler on top of his head, it will what? What, what will it do if you touch it? Release something. It'll, it'll have an orgasm. Is that what you're saying? It'll, have, it'll reach an orgasm. It'll release an orgasm, right? Yeah, those little Pokeballs you see laying out, those are items. Why do they look like Pokeballs? I'll never know. That was probably another Caterpie. What can I say? We're in the fucking Viridian Forest. Of course there's going to be a canopy there, or a bunch of them for that matter. You know, I wish I could keep this uncensored, but my speech is just uncensored. I wish I could keep this clean, but my speech is just so cuss word heavy sometimes. A lot of the time, actually. Uh, and I guess we're going to do our rat out of here, and if it's in here, I'm probably trying to catch it, or this is the first time it's seen. I'm going to say I'm trying to catch it, though. That's what I thought. And a lot of these Pokemon you won't see anymore once I get better ones. I like to keep a certain setup for it, basically. I like to have one of each thing that I can. I trade out certain ones. I like having my electric, I like having my fire, I like having my grass, I like having my water. I like to have those all down. Sometimes I'll carry around a, gro a rock, sometimes I'll carry around a ghost. Uh, sometimes, I'll, sometimes I'll just have a ditto with me, uh, it just depends. Let's say it, my favorite Pokemon in all of the entire thing is probably Cyndaquil, followed by Pikachu. Cyndaquil just happens to be my favorite fire Pokemon. It's just, isn't it just an adorable little uh, uh, fire rodent? <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. Uh, and I won't put in healing things unless it's at the end of the video, because I don't want to take up that time in the video to do it. So you can just keep in mind that if I go into a building and I come right back out of it, it's not really happening. I'm healing in there and then cutting it out. Give you a little insight to the editing process. And you can catch a level, oh, not a level, you can catch a main key here. If you can get it. And I think this is Nidoran male. Yes, Nidoran male. He's over here too. We're like on, what, this is like Route 21, I believe. And it's your direction towards the Indigo Plateau, I think. Uh... So, you know, that works. And did I, what did I run to now? Did I have female? So, they're both over here if you need to catch one. And, like I said, there's also a Mankey over here, if I'm correct. Though, I have been wrong before, but I believe that there is. And if you can get a Mankey, it might help in the, the Pewter City battle as well. Uh, if I'm... If I remember right, low kick is actually a good technique to use 
against his rock Pokemon if he's at a higher level, or a high enough level to learn it. I believe when I played it on for this, I went through early with him, and I didn't level him up really high, but he still had Load Kick, and I think it helped me out a lot there. Uh, but no, you can also meet Gary over here if you haven't met him already. Like I said, his Pokemon be a little bit higher, but not by much. And I think this is where I'm like, okay, let's just do it good over with. I believe mine's name is Douche, though. Yeah. Hey, bud! You going to the Pokemon League? Forget it, you probably don't have any badges. The guard won't let you through. By the way, did your Pokemon... No, I didn't Pokemon. Did your Pokemon get any stronger? I don't know, I didn't poke my Pokemon. Should I poke them more? Would that make them get stronger? Douche wants to battle. Obviously, he's a douche. Douche wants to fight. Obviously, he's a douche. And he sends out a Spearow. No problem. Let's do a Pikachu. Let's go kick some Spearow ass. Let me shock the hell out of that guy. Yeah. P it's Pikachu. Pikachu uses Leer. No, Spearow uses Leer. Yeah, he's a bird Pokemon. Birds are weak against electric. Electricity. I guess they can get zapped by lightning and die. Is that what it is? What? Go Pikachu for leveling up. Like I said, it's, it's 4.30 right now. If I start yawning, then that's why. Yeah, I think I'm sending out Caterpie to get him some extra experience there. Because he's the one I really need to level up. Though, he'll get leveled up off screen, but if he, there's a chance of him evolve or it well, there's a chance. If he evolves, he'll also show you on screen, but then I'll cut to the next evolving part if he evolves again, because I don't want to grind all the time. I don't want to leave all the grinding in, it just seems slow to me. And I kept him in there, or I kept him in there to get a hit and then pulled him back. <laughs> it's kind of a cheap tactic, but he gets the experience for it, which is all I needed him to do. Until he's up to a higher level to where he can actually, you know, attack and do some damage instead. Wow. <gasps> I yawn at 427 and I yawn at 428. Am I going to yawn at 429? Probably. Am I ever going to beat this Eevee? Is the question. <laughs> There I go again, sniffling. Okay. Well, wow, I guess. Or EB dodged it. Wow. Pikachu's defense fail. I don't care. Keep on thunder shocking that bitch. Is it safe to call EB a bitch? Is EB a dog? I think she's a wolf. Or something. I don't know what the hell EB is. But defeat a douche. You know what else I defeat? I also defeat tampons. And. Pads. I, I, I defeat all of that shit. <laughs> I, I defeat toilet paper. I, I, I defeat any type of product you need to use down there. I'm just that awesome, you know. Because if I'm that awesome, there's something shitty about that. No pun intended. Yeah, I thought something was up here. Apparently, talking to Pikachu is what's up here. Pika Pika. I'm not a Pikachu. I didn't mimic that. Talk back down. All right. Well. This video has got about a minute left. I like you want to say that this video had this much time left, so you know how much you're going to be watching, but it, it's obvious if you're watching this, it, it's got a certain amount of time left because it's uploaded. <laughs> You'll see it. <laughs> Alright, so I believe this is coming up to my end. Uh, so these will be done on Saturdays, if I remember. I have enough to get me at least, uh, I think it goes to Misty. Uh, that should be far enough, right? For right now? before I start recording again. Uh, Mario's still up on the way. He's coming. Uh, I think I'll have to do one tomorrow, so... Stay tuned for that. That should be fun. Uh, but... I guess that's about it, really. Thanks for watching uh, Pokemon Yellow. The Pokemon Yellow LP. I'm Bud Gaines, also known as Rankless Warrior, and I have four Pokemon on my Pokedex.